one. Yeah, happy to take care of business tonight for sure. You know, 20 hits is uh, is a positive. That's glass half full, glass half empty. Um, you know, uh, we gave up three or four runs there, and I, I think we got a little sloppy in one of the innings. But uh, other than that, we played pretty good softball, and everybody played. We actually, uh, the casual observer may not have even noticed, but we played two different teams tonight. Uh, we kind of had um, team cardinal, so to speak, uh, played the first five innings, and then another team played the back half, the second five innings, and that's tough on them uh, to kind of stay focused, uh, but uh, was certainly pleased with the overall performance. Uh, Coach, obviously three games uh, three games in now. Just talk about what you're most proud of uh, based off of your team's performance so far. Yeah, I mean, game one, we struggled a little bit offensively. Uh, game two, we uh, turned the corner a bit and uh, put up uh, eight runs against Mississippi State, so that was encouraging. And then to to put double figures and 20 hits. And, you know, there's things that we still need to continue to work on and improve, certainly, uh, and probably will throughout the year. Um, but. Uh, I do think that we're we're hitting the ball pretty well, and we're honestly we're pitching the ball pretty well. And minus one or two boo boos today, we we're playing pretty good defense too. And, and coach, you talked about you know the flip up, you know, you know in Team Cardinal and Team White. Uh, just talk about how important that is during this fall ball schedule to get those players that necessary experience. No, that's exactly right. You know, it's it's an opportunity for everyone to play, everyone to prove themselves, and uh, you know, and and. We always talk about the opponent is the team in the opposite dugout, but there is some competition going on as well within the, within the team, and certainly we want them to handle that in a professional way and, and be supportive of one another. But the truth of the matter is that we are pretty deep and there's a lot of competition going on, so hopefully that's healthy competition. And, and But that, you know, uh, I think there's an old wise saying that iron sharpens iron, and so uh, that's that's kind of what we're going with right now and hoping that uh, the girls will continue to improve. And, and Coach, obviously you can talk all about the performance, the scoreboard, but you mentioned it, keeping the morale up. Just talk about how you feel this team's chemistry is through these first couple games. Yeah, I mean, so far so good. It's uh, And I give a lot of credit to our seniors. We have five seniors and they've really, uh, they've just been super positive with that. They've taken the underclassmen and really bought into them. And, and the thing about, you know, culture wise is, you know, it's, it's like a buzzword, I guess. But uh, anyone who says they have bad culture is, uh, man, that would be tough to admit. But I'm just really proud of the way the girls are supporting one another and loving on one another and, you know, just, just being there for one another. So that's cool to see on and off the field. And uh, they've either got me fooled or the culture is really, really good right now.